Breaking news. A man has been arrested tonight in Utah, suspected in connection with a series of unsolved murders across several states. This court, in agreement with the sentence rendered by the jury, does hereby impose the death penalty upon the defendant, Theodore Robert Bundy. This September, join host Dan Anson for a brand new season of Guts, the only game show in America where players compete to predict the future by reading animal entrails. Our contestants combine luck, strategy, and the ancient Mesopotamian art of divination through the decoding of omens in the viscera of sacrificial animals. This season, contestants will be making predictions in the fields of sports, weather, economics, natural disasters, and since it's an election year, you know we'll be making some predictions about politics. Play along at home with the family. All new episodes starting Monday at 7.30 p.m. I could be on that show. I studied reading the future from animal entrails when I was in college. I'm afraid you have a very serious illness that is causing you to age rapidly. There's no cure, but it can be treated. However, the medication is quite expensive. That game show has a million dollar jackpot. Tonight's category is politics, and we have a new challenger. Who's going to win the big contest on Super Tuesday? Tell us what you see in the entrails, Jim. I can't be reading this right. It says, Ted Bundy. Our next contestant comes straight from West Virginia. Let's everyone give a warm welcome to Nick. Y'all ready to dissect some entrails? Wow, I've never seen entrail reading like that. Congratulations to Nick, our new champion. Sorry, Jim, better luck next time. I'm sorry I beat you in that game show, but we gotta work together now. I've been reading the future in animal entrails since I was a boy, and I've seen all kind of things about Ted Bundy. I reckon it's up to us to expose him for the killer he is. If that rascal becomes president, there ain't no telling what he'll do. Now his followers? They'll do just about anything to get that Peckerwood elected. But I know a feller down in Utah that might have some information. That son of a bitch killed my daughter 40 years ago. Nobody ever believed me, and now he's running for president. That old man didn't tell us much. We're going to have to find some critters to do an entrails reading. It's the only way we can find out where Bundy hid them bodies. It says you will find the secrets in the land of silver. That must mean Nevada. A lot of empty silver mines around them parts that'd be perfect for hiding the body. Bundy killed all these people? I reckon we just ended Ted Bundy's political career. Ain't nobody gonna vote for that scoundrel after the papers get wind of this. Could you keep it down a little? A shocking new development tonight in the race to the White House. As Republican frontrunner Ted Bundy is arrested for a string of murders dating back to the 70s. He is refusing to drop out of the race. I am not guilty. This is absurd. I never killed anyone. This is a political witch hunt. Wait, he fucking won? Hello? Y'all seen the news yet? Yes, I did. You know what we has to do now, right? Yes, we have to kill Ted Bundy.